use this is interesting because i've just not I've, i'm confused as to why this is a thing maybe someone else can explain it to me but you know there's these um the these extinction rebellion raves i kind of get right you're kind of rallying around a cause that you will believe in and there's no better way to kind of you know gain the attention of your everyday folk who don't give a crap by throwing on a little rave but i don't really understand all these protest raves they have when a foreign dignitary who they don't agree with their politics comes over and visits the uk primarily in this case donald trump i just don't get what the purpose of these raves are what do they actually do what do they change how what do they affect or is it just a way for the people that are there to essentially kind of express their frustration in a way that isn't placards and marching i don't know i just don't i've never really understand these raves that happen when trump arrives it's just strange i think there was a few of them before maybe was it last year or was it in the summer when he came again right so this is a story from resident advisor it says london's r3 sound system coincides next protest rave with donald trump uk visit jamie xx steph truxler and more will be able to will be performing at the event starting at 6 p.m on december on tuesday december the 6th obviously jamie xx lives here steph truxler i think lives in ibifa but maybe he's, he's here for the winter months i'm not too sure um i'm assuming they're going to be playing for free um i'm assuming they're both quite politically minded so that's why they're getting involved but i just don't know what the purpose of this is like what does it do um let's continue reading the article they might tell us london's r3 sound system is mobilizing again to protest um against the politics of donald trump um nigel farage and boris johnson okay all three uh the chosen date is tuesday the december the third the day trump arrives in the uk for the nato heads of state summit uh, the protest running partnership with the Love Music, Hate Racism and Standard Racism will feature the likes of Seth Chuxler, uh, Shy Girl, Gideon, Midland, Jamie XX, High, Horsemeat Disco and 808 State. That is a banging lineup though, isn't it? That lineup is mean. I don't get it, but I probably might end up going there. I'd take everything back, all my cynicism. I might just go just for the rave. That's a mean lineup, man. Bloody hell. Again, it's nice when they have raves like this in, in December because usually... December is usually the kind of like, you know, winding down time for most DJs. Everyone's kind of back home, finishing off projects, finishing off EPs, fin you know, refining their DJ skills, buying vinyl, listening to demos. Everyone's just chilling, connecting with their family they haven't seen in six months. So there's a lot of real cool DJs about who you can kind of, you know, if you're f friendly with them and familiar with them, you can maybe get them involved. And it's on a Tuesday, right? So that's you know you effectively got the option to get everyone involved because there's nowhere in london that's going to be open on a tuesday it's going to be booking these people that's an insane lineup man so good okay this is the flyer dance music against trump boris and farage crossed out in red with a fist at the back of course for the december trafalgar square 6 p.m so it might be one of those kind of you know um moving uh, buses with speakers on it similar to what you might see on in the carnival and stuff that might work but yeah a crazy lineup man that's a whole lineup oh eats everything is playing as well norman J. wow mike dunn is there as well adonis jasper james mama mia that is a mad lineup roscoe a guy called gerald <laughs> this flipping is a mad lineup it's really cool i'm not gonna lie i'm actually take back my sense it looks really cool really cool lineup um check it out if you're that way inclined a really um solid cause i'm assuming for the most of it again i don't know what it does in terms of actually change, moving the needle but maybe this is part of a series of things that can lead to some kind of change who knows but check it out on resident advisor it's listed in now it's called dance music against trump and boris on the 3rd of december presented by r3 sound system